what is up everybody in this video i'm going to show you how you can fix pip is not recognized as an internal or external command operable program or batch file so you must have installed python and you must have tried to use pip for installing some package so if i write pip install pandas i got this error now what is the reason i got this error either your python is not installed correctly or you have not added pip to your path now what does that mean when I install Python, I will have to add Python to my path. So if I write Python here, it's showing me the version of Python. I'll exit Python by writing exit and I'll now explain you how to add pip to your path. I have installed my Python in this folder. Here is the folder where my Python is installed. I added this folder to my path variable. Now what does that mean? That means whenever you try to access Python from anywhere on this computer, it will automatically find this address and it will run this python.exe. Now we want to do the same thing with pip also. So if I open my scripts, here is my pip.exe. So if I add this address to my path, then I'll be able to use pip. Let me add this address to path and copy it. Now right click on your this pc now this is where the main thing begins you just right click on your my pc click on properties click on advanced system settings now click on environment variables and click on path this path under system variables now if you click edit you can see there are some of the variables already out there python 35 is one of them now if i delete this path then i'll not be able to use python but I want to add my pip to this environment variable. I'll click on new and I'll paste by using control V and then I'll press OK. Now if I click OK and again I click OK and restart my command prompt and write pip, I'll be able to use pip. It's running something, it will show me the options and will not show me the error that I was getting previously. So now if I write pip install pandas, you can see it's telling me requirement already satisfies because I've already installed this package. Using the similar step, you can fix your error too and let me know if you have any problems. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like this video so that others can also watch it and make sure to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.